<laughs> Puppies. Everybody get along. <laughs> Say hi, communicate. All right, we're good. Keanu Reeves could be just like other celebrities, but he takes the subway. He's sitting down enjoying the ride when he notices the woman standing next to him. Without waiting for anyone else to act, he shows just how much of a gentleman he is. This Keanu clip makes every other celebrity look like an amateur. He wanted his stunt team to know exactly how much he appreciates their work. So what better way than with a luxury gift? Not that anyone would need an excuse to work with Keanu Reeves. Keanu took the four-man stunt crew out to dinner and he gifted them with personalized Rolexes. What? Wow. Yeah, there's Rolling me waving on the back reading the John Wick 5 with a thank you to each of wow. the guys. Isn't that cool? That, that is really cool. That is so yeah. cool. Yeah. Ooh, Keanu has raised the bar for co-workers. Yeah, exactly. Imagine finally meeting your favorite celebrity. When actress Octavia Spencer was new to Hollywood, she found herself in an awkward situation in a very public setting. I was on my way to to pick up a script to read for an audition. So I wasn't really wearing any underwear. I was wearing sweat <laughs> and uh, my favorite college uh, football t-shirt. It was worn. I mean, it was see-through, okay? <laughs> no underwear, guys. Let's put it this way. It's definitely not how most people would want to meet Keanu Reeves. My car hadn't been washed because I always parked underneath the tree and there was bird crap all over the back of it. <laughs> and it broke down like in this very posh area of Beverly Hill. Cars were honking, nobody would help me. Then all of a sudden this guy comes up with his sunglasses and motorcycle helmet and I knew immediately it was Keanu Reeves. And I of course was like freaking out. I thought he was going to get into the car. I got behind the car to push. He said, no, I'm going to push you out of the street. You get in. When people saw it was Keanu Reeves helping me, Everybody came down <laughs> to help. Keanu has fans of all ages. He might be badass Neo in The Matrix, but to this little boy, Keanu is just another human. Kids are known for asking the hard questions, and coming up with the right answer is a challenge. It's just that Keanu manages to make it look easy. How did you go into the computer? So I would have my hand, and they would take a picture of it, and then in a computer, they would do an animation of all like a silver and they would show you on a movie screen. <laughs> Alan's a master at leaving people speechless, so when there's a competition to be won, you know the prize is going to be incredible. These women made their excitement about meeting Keanu Reeves very obvious, but he knew how to handle their reaction and make their day. This is Jennifer. Hi, Jennifer. Hi. What are you doing here? I um, played a game on Ellen's show and I won. Uh, well, how'd you oh, yeah, Jennifer. <laughs> how is it like kissing Keanu Reeves? It was great. <laughs> and then you have to play this scene where it's like, you know, I've loved you since I was seven. Oh my god. You're so good looking. What happens when a kid gets to meet their hero? We're sure this boy was the coolest kid in school the next day. I'm such a big fan. What's your name? Noah. My name is Noah. You're probably my favorite actor in the whole world. Oh my gosh, Noah. Best. Thank you. Did you see Duke Kaboom in Toy Story 4? Yeah, he's my favorite character. Canada's greatest stuntman. Well, I'm glad you liked it. He not only got to meet Keanu Reeves, he also got to show him his drawing skills. It's certain he chose the right actor to be his hero. Do you draw? I could do like a quick little sketch of Spider-Man. Let's do it. You want black, red, or silver? Red. Thank you. You too. Nice to meet you, young man. Getting married is a day filled with nerves and excitement, so no one imagines adding a celebrity into the mix. James and Nikki never expected to be meeting Keanu Reeves, and when they casually share their wedding photos, that would make some people very jealous. We all know that celebrities express gratitude in speeches, but how many celebrities would take it to this level? No reaction could compare to Keanu's gesture at Comic-Con 2022. Being in this fan's video is a kind gesture in itself, and we're sure this man would have been satisfied with that. But when you're Keanu, you do more than just smile and say hi. My favorite actor 
<laughs> How's it going, Rio? Nice to see you. Nice to meet everyone. Have a good In day Iran. out there. You on? In Iran, man. <laughs> Peace from Hollywood. Picture this. You're a kid eagerly waiting for your mom to come home. She walks through the door and casually shows you this video. It's just Keanu Reeves looking back at you. Is this real life? Say thank you. And I hope you have a great holiday. And you have a, a wonderful, beautiful daughter. And all my best. Thanks, Keanu. You're the best. As if you needed another reason to adore Keanu, one sunny day in 1998, he spent time with someone most people would go out of their way to avoid. Here he is enjoying a conversation and sharing his food with a homeless man in West Hollywood. We don't blame this woman for questioning what she was seeing. Sometimes our eyes see what we want to see. Who would expect to stumble upon Keanu Reeves while out buying wine? He's a lookalike. He's a lookalike, right? No one wants their plane to make an emergency landing, but who wouldn't want Keanu on their plane? The passengers on this Los Angeles-bound flight did not expect to meet Keanu. He even went out of his way to keep people calm. Here's some footage from this unexpected event. Vans will be here in an hour, so if you want to hit the road and then deal with your bags later, or deal with customer service and get it delivered, maybe. Yeah. Its population is around 380,000, making it the ninth most populous city in California and the 52nd most populous city in the nation. More proof that working with Keanu Reeves would be awesome. Here he is gathering everyone on the set of John Wick 4 to say a few words. It would make all the hard work even more worth it. It's uh, really special to be here, but it's not only the place that's special, it's all the people and everyone, so many great people and artists, and so thank, thank you, you for all your support. John Wick 4. Keanu is known for being considerate towards his fans. You can tell from his body language with this woman that he wants her to feel comfortable. He even goes out of his way to bend down and keep her safe. How you treat your young fans says a lot about you as a celebrity. This kid would have tested most people's patience, let alone someone famous. Once again, Keanu shows he does things differently. Andrew Kimmel has the evidence to prove it. Here is a heartwarming story about Keanu Reeves and a lucky grandma. The Reddit user explains his uncle bumped into Keanu at a restaurant and told him that his mom had a crush on him, that it would mean the world if he could call her. Keanu asked if he had a phone on him and then made it happen. Part of being famous means putting up with the fans and paparazzi everywhere you go. Everyone was on alert after Keanu and his girlfriend, Alexandra Grant, left a New York City hotel. How would you expect him to react? You already know. This is Keanu Reeves we're talking about. Uh, you got a minute, Ken? Uh, I'll show you something. No, no, one thing. Yo, give me an That's you ready. Me you got the address? Give him the address. You don't have it. I right, text. All right, I'll put it on, on your phone. Okay. Love you, kids. Take care of yourself. All right. Keanu might be the star of the movie, but he makes sure to act like he's just an ordinary guy. Here he is lending a hand to the crew on the set of John Wick 4. We all know Keanu loves motorbikes, so it's not surprising he was at the EICMA motorcycle show in 2018. But what happened next, no one could have predicted. A man crashed through the barrier, but Keanu didn't miss a beat, he was first on the scene. This woman had no idea she backed into Keanu Reeves' beloved motorbike. She even argued that the bike was parked illegally. Keanu tried to keep the peace and even shook her hand. He said he would let it go on one condition, if his bike started. Uh oh, Keanu Reeves' bike just got run over. It's not in the red. It's, uh, it's parked illegally. This is a legal park. Back into your bike. No Burko. Come on, man. Side. Guys, come on. Give us five minutes, okay? Let's go. 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 Let's go.